Hello everybody, I am Richard Vigarelli, your guide to everything Chinese astrology and TCM and everything just a tinge on the weird side. So, we are now halfway through the animals. <laughs> and we're starting off with the water horse in this one. So, what is the water horse? What does the water horse mean? Well, first of all, we got to examine the horse like always. So, let's think about the horse. What does the horse mean? Well, the horse is all about change and movement, just like the galloping creature on the plains and the moors and the fields and the prairie, etc., etc., etc. They're very loyal, hardworking, outrageously hardworking, and they expect that from people. They don't like laziness you will probably never see anybody with a horse in their chart sitting down thumbing through the channels on the TV. They're not about that. They want to get out. They want to do things. They want to build. They want to create. And they want to do it for themselves and for everybody else. So, what happens when you put water in on top of that? Well, that will create somebody that has the ability to work very, very, very hard for the people that they serve. Because water is all about teaching, it's about healing, it's about diving deep. So this horse will have an uncanny ability to stay up long nights. Let's say they're, they move, get into becoming a doctor. Just why not? This person will go the extra mile for their patient. They will do anything and everything in their ability to make sure that their patient gets through. Maybe just the night. Maybe just the next hour. And they will work tirelessly to create a cure and to then tell people about that cure, and to get things moving, to get things created, because they will never, ever back down from anything hard to do. Same thing will go for a teacher that happens to be a horse, especially, well, a water horse for that matter, because water is about teaching. That teacher will be kind of a lot like Robin Williams' character in, uh, oh, in um, Dead Poets Society. He will change things in such a way that it just makes sense. And he won't stop. Even if you make him stop. He'll go behind your back and do it his way. Because he is not necessarily loyal to you. He is loyal to the people he is serving because that's the nature of a horse. Horses are also fantastic entrepreneurs. So with the water ability in there, let's say this person goes into business, this person is going to be all about fixing that industry. If that industry impacts the world, he is going to use his industry, use his business to change the world for the better, at least as he sees it. So everyone, this has been my interpretation of the Chinese water horse. If you are new to my channel, please feel free to subscribe below. You can leave me uh, your name and birth information in the comments and I will run your chart for you. Or, barring that, you can go to my website at vigintmed.com. That stands for Vigorelli Integrated Medicine.com. And please send me a message. I'll be back next time with the wood horse and what the wood horse means. Until then, we'll see you later. Have an awesome day.